What's up everybody, this is the Nintendo fan, and we're here playing some more Wario Land 3. In the last part, we started our adventure after crashing near a magic music box which transported us in the world within it. And in this part, we're going to continue our adventure with the volcano's base. Well, let's explore. Alright, now it's been a while since I last played in these levels, so I don't remember much. Alright. Oh yeah, you can actually uh, stop your uh, arm thrust by hitting down after it. And jump. And I jumped too late. Yeah, this level revol revolves around uh, using those rolling hills, and we made it. And we get these guys, and that'll try to attack Wario as he's climbing something. You gotta be patient. Let's go up this pipe. And we have a card here. Not doing anything. Um, I think that's for later. And we could have gotten that a uh, music coin, but oh well. And we can't go down that pipe. But yeah, you need a lot of good timing. And I couldn't jump high enough. Good job, me. And we got a, the gray key. Hang on a second. And that's as far as we can go. We just go up this platform, just like any other side scroller. You see a thin platform, you go through it. And we can't go up this pipe either. Yeah, it's a nice shortcut. <laughs> Back. Oh yeah, in certain areas, you can actually get different colored coins depending on the what chest color you you're gonna get. Like I got a gray coin, which I believe is worth 50 coins if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Oh, I I think I know what to do. We'll have good timing for one thing. There we go. And there's that gray coin I was talking about. Let's go up this pipe. And we have a boss fight against Doll Boy. What you want to do is hit the glowing barrels and watch out for his hammers. Otherwise, Wario becomes a springy Wario. Like that. Thus, we missed the way to the chest. And we have to start the fight over again, in true Moldorn fashion. Alright, let's try this again. Oh. Watch out! I messed it up again. I think I'm doing the last part wrong. And as you see, the doll boy resembles a giant <laughs> Daruma doll, which is one of those uh, Japanese uh, dolls. Those are pretty interesting. Okay, third time's the charm. Ooh, that was close. Ah, guy got hit. I do like the uh, boss music here. Uh, 
Alright. For the fourth time, let's do this. You need a lot of patience. Dang it! At least those, uh, spikes stop the, uh, springy Wario effect. But at least you're not transported out of the level. Dang it! How do I keep messing this up? There we go. Wow, I just rushed that one. Yeah, that's the thing about those bosses. You need patience to be able to defeat them. Okay, this is like, what, my sixth attempt? <laughs> now seventh? I lost count, to be honest. Okay. Not rushing this. Uh oh. Oh! Now we defeated Dollboy. And we have an up hammer here. Let's go through that door. And that's our way to the gray chest. And we got some uh, overalls, which is actually a power-up <laughs> in this game. And it's showing us a tutorial that allow us to pound on enemies, as well as cracked <laughs> blocks. And some, and these uh, frogs are whatever they're called. Now we can go back to Out of the Woods and the Vast Plain. Nice. And now it's night time. Keep that in mind for later. And I'm gonna go Out of the Woods. We haven't been there at night time. And we can pound this guy. There we go. And we got these cranes here, which grab onto Wario, which don't do anything at first. And we got a red coin. No, we don't need to collect eight of them to get a star. Or shine, if it's Mario Sunshine. And we got these guys here, which can flatten Wario. I like the way Wario looks. <laughs> it looks pretty funny. But, to get Wario unplanned, remember those crane guys we saw? They do the job. But, let's break these blocks. And it missed. Until now. They, those guys were to pound by, over by the ladder you're climbing. Wario would automatically go down the ladder. Oh no. And I got cocooned. Well, at least I'm not going down anywhere. We have these doors here. See that uh, enemy knocked down? Let's go through. And we have a game of golf here. And we paid 10 coins to play one round. So let's do it. And we have to be... 
reached the hole under or within par, and I missed the enemy, which actually counts as a stroke, by the way. Stupid, I know. And I landed on the rough where my next shot's not gonna go as far, and I'm gonna go in the water, aren't I? Yeah, I'm just gonna throw that one. Now, there are actually three different kinds of courses. <laughs> and game over, yeah, yeah, yeah. Trying this again. And we have a par four this time. And nothing but fairway. That's... That's looking good. I missed. Are you serious? And we have a lava trap here. Which is actually the hazard. I... I messed this up. Are you kidding me? Alright, trying this again, and we got a par 3. And I landed in the bunker. Which actually uh, makes the, the enemy go less and further. And we made it in! Cleared. Doing that raises those uh, tiles up. This way. And I like how the uh, doorway disappears as soon as you approach the chest. And let's see what's in it. Looks like a pot of something. I really don't know what the names of those treasures are called. It's actually a, a jar with a pot rain cloud in it. But before I go to the vast plane, I'm gonna explore the new uh, area. Actually, I'm gonna go to the vast plane first. And do something about this frog here. Or is it a frog? I'm not sure. I always thought they looked like frogs. There we go. And if you get hit by those guys, Marty gets uh, stung and gets inflated. And inflates up to the um, new platform. But we have another golf game, so let's do it. And we're gonna get the rough. Not as bad as the bunker. And that's what I call Wario Golf. Ooh. I missed it in the end. Are you kidding me? Alright. I missed the bunker, thankfully. Ooh, I missed the other bunker. Ugh. Ah, oh, I barely missed it. Dang it. Well, at least we have plenty of coins. And we have a water hazard. You're kidding me. And we get the penalty stroke. This is... 
Oh, I have to make this one. No! I was so close! Yeah, these are jerkish <laughs> golf course designs. Ooh, just missed the rough there. I believe I landed in the water. Are you kidding me? I believe the uh, blue parts are supposed to be like the top spin or back spin. Yeah, I'm not gonna get this one. I'm just gonna throw it. And I got four, three attempts left. Hole in one! That's better. And we cleared the minigame. And there should be an mini game door nearby. And it's a good thing we got stung. Because that's where the red key is. I mean, yeah, you can actually get plenty of points in this game, so... It's no bi Don't split it if you mess up a lot in the golf game. Yeah, no you don't. I am not getting up there. But yeah, if you get stung and hit a wall or those spikes, or you actually have deep lights. And we have a music note coin. And we approach the chest. Let's see what it contains. A crayon of some kind. Alright, it just colored this in um, cave area. And really quick, I'm just gonna... Go turn it to daytime. Because the next level, I like the uh, daytime theme of it a lot. It's the pool of rain. Let's do it. But yeah, I love this music here. And keep that sound in mind for later. And as you expect with the title called Pool of Rain, we have water here. And these uh, fish are enemies later. But what you want to do is pound those pegs. Nit, you got some. Bu you got an interesting puzzle to solve. And these guys here have their spikes on top. Yeah, I like the, the music here a lot. Uh oh. I can't get back up. Uh oh. Alright, uh, let's see if it's. Yep, I raised that. Let's see if I can raise it higher. Yes, I can. Going up. Yes, I am. And that gets us that gray key. Uh oh. Ah, I had a feeling that was going to happen again. Well, at least I have a shortcut. Take that. Oh, this is interesting. Uh, 
There we go. I'll get rid of you. Nothing over here. So let's go down. And you actually uh, can actually ground pound as you're going down the ladder. But we made it to the gray chest. Let's see what we got. A wheel of some kind. And I'm going to the town. Let's go to the town in chaos. Which actually has the same music in a peaceful village. Yeah, I like that. This level a lot, actually. And let's go up this ladder. And we got these polar bears here. They hit you with their ice attack. Where it gets frozen, it slides. And that's it. And these blobs, guys, pretty much are a nuisance. And we got those fire robots. And we see the red key. I think it's too soon for us to be in this area. And I do like the pictures of the vegetables, which is nice. Hey, shortcut to the top. How do you like that? And we can actually t destroy the big enemies. Uh-oh. I believe these enemies act normally take it two hits to defeat. Unless you unless you have a side effect in play. Oops. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? Yep. It takes two hits to defeat these guys. Unless you stun them. Well boy. Ooh, that was close. And we got the donut guys again. Let's see. We got the gray key. And we got the zombie guys, which we can actually encounter in a peaceful village during the nighttime. And we'll be and getting hit by those guys turns us into zombie Wario, which allows us to phase through the these small platforms downward. And let's see here. You can actually hit those uh, pots with the uh, warriors down or warriors thru arm thrust. And we want to go hit it to this uh, window. Let's see what's beyond it. It's the way out. Oh no. Let's try that again, shall we? And I ate the donuts. Go down again. Now you can actually defeat enemies as Zombie Wario, which is cool. Oh boy! Now you can actually jump while on fire, which actually uh, delays the uh, fire effect in the end. I'm starting to think I came here too soon. out of here. Oh boy. Oh, I remember what to do. Grab this zip line and roll as if you're going down a hill and we could not get that coin. We have another cog, actually. That other, other item we got was actually a cog. And 
That lift gives us access to the next uh, part of the map, the south side part. And gives us access to the grasslands. And you know what? We've done a lot in this part, so I think I'm gonna end things up here. And in the next part, we're gonna explore the grasslands, alright? Later, guys!